everyone, it's Rose, and I'm back with another unboxing video. So this one is from Evermoment, and it's uh, one of my November 11th purchases during their big 11-11 sale. So today is November 27th, so it arrived very, very quickly. Now, um... Let's just see here. This one is from the EM store, which is an Evermoment store. And you'll see the iconic Evermoment tube in just a moment. Um, this, this was shipped on the 14th, so it took two weeks to get to me from China. Oh, I kind of did it in the ribbon, but that's okay. Alright, so there we go. It's uh, branded with the Evermoment uh, stuff. Unfortunately, I uh, tore the, well, I didn't tear the ribbon, but I, um, I uh, untied it. Oh, okay, first, hold on, I'm going to open the other end. But I don't want to press down on my table while I close this end again. Okay. So they uh, they provide an item number on all of their diamond paintings. This one, oops. This one is 3F2175. And it's a 60 by 60 centimeter with 41 colors. Okay. So let's open this up and take a look at the painting. So these ever moment tubes I do keep because they're great if you want to um, ship a painting to somebody as a gift or something like that. So I have a storage locker downstairs and uh, I'll be taking all my tubes down there to store. All right. So there we go. That's everything that's in the tube. So let's take a look at what comes in the bag. Let's take a look at all the, uh, the goodies first. So they send quite a lot of bags, um, which is wonderful because you can use those for diamond painting, uh, leftover drills and things like that. Or if you like to work out of bags, you could put your drills in the big bags. They also now are sending little pieces of washi tape. So this is uh, like a green, if it's sparkly or not it doesn't look sparkly but it's just a little piece uh, just a little uh, roll of washi tape so that's sweet I like that uh, then you have the ever moment diamond painting kit so you have the ever moment tweezers which are very very sharp pointed uh, you have the single placer with this one has either a very large cushy or two cushies. It looks like a very large cushy and it's got a three placer here on the end. We also see in here, I think it's a six placer. Uh, I was trying to use one of these the other day. I don't like them. So I don't know, maybe I'm just not good at it, but I tried for a while and I didn't like that. Um, so I'll stick with the three and four placers for now. And then there's two big pieces of wax and the um, white boat with a funnel. So, very nice kit. Then we have three bags of drills and they always label their drills. So again, you have the item number, the size, how many colors in total, and how many bags you've got. So, we'll take a look at those drills in a moment. Now, you get an inventory sheet with Evermoment, and you'll see here they are always double stamped. So they actually are inspected twice. Uh, and here we have our 41 colors. You can take a look at the symbols as they appear on here, because it'll be easier than me trying to 
hold steady on the canvas. And you'll also be able to see about how many drills. Uh, so in total, there's 57,600 drills on this diamond painting. So let's take a look at some of these symbols. They are the standard Evermoment symbols. You know what? I'm going to get way close up with this. There we go. All right. I'm very partial to the jelly roll. I like the jelly roll. Uh, so far I'm not seeing anything that I'm going to be confused by. Okay, so that's good. And I call it the lionfish. Oops. Let me just zoom out a little bit. And that's why. Because it's a lion that's a fish. Now this is a, um, originally art by uh, someone named Kirby Rosan, or Rosans, and uh, he is uh, um, a comic book illustrator, I think, but he also does illustration for adult coloring books. So this is one of his paintings that was turned into um, a diamond painting, which is pretty cool, I think. Okay. And then uh, here we see a perfect ever moment canvas. There is absolutely nothing wrong with this canvas. It is, you don't get much more perfect than that. Okay. So I'm just gonna let this relax a little bit. There are no rivers, there's no nothing just this lovely canvas and I think you can see all of it in the picture so um, it is one large piece of adhesive so I'm going to pull that back towards me and try not to try not to rip okay let's now this looks really dark because of course even though the color whoops even though the colors are quite light uh, in many cases uh, the printing on them is black so um, mostly black anyway so um, so that's why sometimes you'll get a canvas and you'll open it up and you'll think oh that's too dark it's not it's just that uh, all the printing on the canvas makes it look a little bit dark Oh, this is in multiple sheets. Okay, so I'm gonna do this a little differently. That It was laid so perfectly that I didn't realize that there were multiple sheets. And on the back, you cannot tell that there are multiple sheets. Usually there's a little bit of a seam, not a seam, but just uh, there's a mark on the back from um, where Okay, I'm not going to go any further than that because that's about half an inch from the edge of the drill area. So, I just don't want to be pulling up the adhesive from the canvas, which is why I'm taking my time here. I want to make sure it's still in view for you. Yeah, mostly. Mostly. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I think that'll do. Okay. There we go. And again, I'm going to take it to just about a half an inch or so from the edge of the canvas. There we go. From the edge of the uh, drill area, rather. So, um, so yeah, there you, you have it. Um, let me turn it so that it's facing the right way for you. There. I think it's going to look nice. I think it's going to look nice. Here are the colors, and I mean, take a look. That's a very light blue there. 
and that's going to be you know one of the main colors there's an awful lot of it and then the green as well so between these two colors there's so much of them so this is much showing is much much darker than the final image is going to be and once again I'll just hold this up here so that you can see what it's going to look like. Oh, let me get that in focus. There we go. That's what it's going to look like compared to what it looks like undrilled. All right. Um, I always do this, so I'm going to take you out of the cradle and I'm going to bring you down to show you the drill area. And once again, I'm going to go to super zoom. Look how clear that printing is. Now here you can vaguely just, whoops, right there. You can just see here the, um, the seam between the two pieces of adhesive. Now I'm trying to hold this steady, but when it's zoomed out, any little movement is going to make it um, jiggle. Yeah. Yeah, very, very, very nice. Very nice. So we'll just come out. There's the lion's head. I love the way the body morphs into a fish. That's why I call it the lionfish. I actually am going on a, a, a kick with fish type creatures. So there's quite a few fish that I've been buying lately. Okay, so I'm going to pause for a moment. I'm gonna set the camera up so that we can do Inventory. You don't really have to do inventory with Ever Moment. They've never been missing anything uh, in all the kits that I've bought. But I always do inventory anyway. And I get to show you the beautiful colors. Okay, now just before I do the inventory of the colors, I want to measure because I always do. Again, I've never been disappointed by Ever Moment but I will measure, it's supposed to be 60 by 60. It is exactly 60 by 60. Yeah, so I will just, oops, just confirm that on here, 60 by 60. I'm starting to use labels now instead of um, instead of writing it on with indelible marker. Okay, there we go. So that's the lionfish. And I'm just gonna bring you down and we're gonna do some inventory together. Okay, I wanna give as much room as possible for the drills. So well, let's start with bag one of three. Now I do save these Evermoment bags, but I don't put the drills back in the Evermoment bags. Because I can never make them look quite that nice. Okay. So I just want to make sure that these are all different colors here. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So 964. There are 800 in here, I think. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. So that's 8,000. And that's 964.
So let's just see. We'll go through the list and just make sure that there's a dot beside every number. And of course there is, because this is ever moment, and I've never had a problem with an ever moment. Okay, so this is, what, that, what number is that? Number 259. Okay. Lionfish, it's 60 by 60, and it's square. And it's from EM Store. Okay, that's it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I love your comments, so please leave me a comment down below. And uh, do come back and visit with me again soon. All right, everybody? Thanks. Bye-bye. I want to take a moment to thank my patrons for their support of my channel. Uh, you guys, it's, uh, it makes me feel so good to know that there are people out there who enjoy my channel enough to contribute a couple of dollars a month to keep it going. And uh, I'm going to do all I can to uh, bring you the kinds of videos that you tell me you like and that my viewership enjoys. So, uh, so thank you so very much.